The other interview tonight with the victim of another brutal crime, an Asian American man suddenly attacked and beaten. Tonight, he's telling his terrifying ordeal to Eyewitness News reporter NJ Burkett. I remember it's tree. Yeah, 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 it's tree. Tao Ming Soon says he never saw it coming. The fist that landed in his left eye and knocked him to the sidewalk. He was on his way home from work shortly before 11 o'clock last night, 11 o'clock last night, about to enter the F train at East Broadway when he was attacked. In this cell phone video, the suspect appears first. He's clearly waiting for his victim, and the attack comes out of nowhere. Tao Ming soon falls to the pavement, where he will be punched in the eye and elbowed in the mouth repeatedly. It's over in seconds and the suspect takes off into the subway where surveillance cameras captured his face as he crossed the turnstile and onto an F train. Too fast. I cannot remember anything. Mm. Too fast happened. There was no obvious motive for the attack. Detectives converged on the neighborhood today, canvassing residents and shopkeepers for clues, determined to identify the attacker. A $2,500 reward is being offered for information. Tao Ming soon told us the man did not look familiar and he has no idea what provoked the attack. He's a 56-year-old construction worker, an immigrant from Malaysia, who has lived in the United States for more than 20 years. You don't know why he did that? I don't know. Sorry. Have you ever seen that guy before? No, I was here. I was here before. Why do you think this guy attacked you? Why? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I ask him. The NYPD's Hate Crimes Task Force is investigating. It's still not clear whether this was or was not a biased crime, but it is yet another random attack in a community that is already on edge tonight.